Hey guys, today we're crafting. I'm sure we'll be using glitter. Maybe we'll do some painting. Do these colors suit me? Hmm. Should we do some pop art? I don't know what we're gonna craft today, but let's get started. So remember this old frame I showed you we got in the garbage? Well, I'm just rubbing it with a sponge with a little white paint because it really is like green and gross. And then we're going to decorate it. Look at the difference, guys. Just what a little bit of the white paint compared to that crazy, I don't know, old goldy green. And this is just lightly with a towel. I started with a sponge. But my sponge fell apart. It was too soft. So then I'm just rubbing it on with a towel. So we're going to let this dry and see if we're going to put another coat or not. But I already like this vintage antique look going on here. So for the second coat, guys, because you see there's still a lot of black and green showing, I take a regular paintbrush. It's not a super soft brush, and I'm just dabbing. Okay, guys, so that's what the two coats that I showed you. It's dry. Um, I moved the hanger because it was supposed to be hung long ways, I guess, but I needed it the other way. So I just moved the hanger because I have a certain idea I want to do with this, guys. So now we're going to take string and I'm going to staple it across and I'll show you. So I took two pieces of string and I stapled it and I'm going to kind of do this with it all the way across and then staple it on the other side. Okay, so once you have that across, you're going to do one more lower just like that. And I just stapled it, guys. That's it. So now that we have our string on, we are going to put our fabric behind it. Okay, and I just stapled the fabric to the back. Didn't stress myself. The piece fit perfect. It's these kind of fabric things you could get from Michaels or whatever. And this is, was the size for this frame. But depending on what size frame you're going to use is how much fabric you're going to need. You could probably use those Dollar Tree fabrics if the frame is smaller. All right, guys, as you see, I'm going to use it to hold accessories like sunglasses and headphones and anything else, which is why I did the string like this so I could actually stick maybe even S hooks if I wanted to hang something that didn't, wasn't able to hang. So yeah, so that's what I did. And I think I want to put some flowers on the bottom. All right, guys, I put some flowers, a bow, and there you go. That's some of my sunglasses <laughs> have an obsession, obviously. But you can hang, like I said, anything. You can hang S hooks and hang things off. You could put your necklaces around and have your necklaces hanging. You could do a whole bunch of stuff. You can just get the little um, clothes uh, pins and put notes and stuff. You could do whatever you like. Another very versatile project that you can do basically for really really cheap because we found the frame in the garbage i'm sure everybody has some kind of frame somewhere and a piece of fabric some string you don't have to put the flowers that's optional so yeah it came out really really gorgeous guys there you go guys it's so cute thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next adventure